Hello YouTubers and welcome back to Matchlock Studios with me Edward Nash and today we're looking at the Tabletop Workshop Cottage um, I've done a really an unboxing video of this so we're just moving on to the painting I've already base painted the colours so we have uh, dark in there for the base which would be the cobblestones and uh, a light sandy cream colour for the sides of the buildings this is hopefully will um, decrease on time of painting so this is going to be mainly a lot of dry brushing and detail on the detail work on the buildings themselves we've got interior and exterior detail to put in as well so i'll stop the gift of the gab and the waffle and uh, get on with the important thing of uh, painting sit back and enjoy Now with uh, the basing done, we're going to bring out the roof and start on the roof with a nice basing of a darkish yellow to make it look like thatched roofing. Now I'm going to try and weather this and dull it down at later stages, but for now we're going to put a nice thick coat on just to really pop it out. So I accidentally um, missed a bit of the video here, uh, didn't realise the camera wasn't actually recording. So what we've done is started on the uh, walls, doing a dry brushing of white on the walls. Um, sorry we've missed that bit out. And now we're going over all the wooden parts with a contrast paint, a Citadel Contrast, Corax Brown, um, just picking out all the uh, wooden details. Do. 
Whack full of day, little dee doy do. Fiddle little day, little dee doy do. Whack full of day, little dee doy do. Shalala no, shalala no. Fiddle little day, little dee doy do. Oh, the fear I heard it. Whack full of day, little dee doy do. Shalala no, shalala no. Fiddle little day, little dee doy do. Oh, the fear I heard it. Whack full of day, little dee doy do. Shalala no, shalala no. Fiddle little day, little dee doy do. So now we've just um, speeded up the time that all the sides and walls are done. I'm going to go back to the base and start dry brushing with a nice little bit of white just to pick out all the details on the base plate on the cobble floor. Then we'll be moving on to the details on the walls very shortly. Oh, a bit too heavy there. So now I'm going to go with a nice light dry brush. And as you can see, it makes a world of difference. Now I'm going to start on the roof. Again, nice soft white. Going to pick out all the raised areas. And this will be weathered down as well. And now we're going to start dry brushing the white onto the outside of the buildings to give that a nice weather to look and make all the wood details pop out as well. Now I'm just using a little bit of metal uh, paint to bring out all the iron work like the uh, hinges here on the doors and any of the rivets. Um, there is very very little iron work uh, on this set. Now we're going to flip it over and start to work on the inside interior of the building. So the shelving, the pegs, all the wooden timbers inside. And again we're going using the contrast paint Corax brown for the internal as well.
So, okay then there, folks. We've got all the external and now internal painting finished. Now it comes to the job of assembling. And with these kits from uh, tab Tabletop Workshop, they are really, really easy and good kits to put together. So what we've got to do is just slot them in there. Push it to the side. Pop this side in. Click it in. Put it to the side. Take the end. It nicely clicks all together and is very, very solid and sturdy. You know, it's very well made in the design. It's fantastic. Pop the roof on and there we have it. We have a nice medieval cottage put together and ready to go into the tabletop. Or for a diorama scene or whatever you like to use it for. So, not bad for my second attempt at doing a painting video. I hope everyone's enjoyed it. Um, if you have, please leave a comment below. Anything I could have done different, better. I am a novice at doing YouTube videos. I am slowly learning. Um, and also doing painting. So, if you've got any tips and tricks, guys, please let us know in the comments. Uh, have a look at subscribing to us for more stuff. And also check out our next videos, which will be coming up somewhere over there. And I'll subscribe button there. So, uh, take care, guys, out there. And we'll see you hopefully soon for some more videos. Take care. Bye-bye for now.